yard line. Dungy's first pass is complete to his number one target, Jamal Custis. See an empty formation. Dungy, quick release, caught near the markers. Dungy's pass is complete. Custis leaning Jamal towards Custis that first down that he had to get to the 15. This and push the ball back inside where it could be tackled. On third down, little sidearm pass. Custis gets around the first would-be tackler and has a big gain for a first down. Part and he's got what they want. Custis has three receptions, make it four to lead the Orange. And again, size-wise, he is so much taller than those defending him, especially here today. Myron Morris giving up four inches and 40 pounds. I'd like to be able to see him sustain those runs and make them big plays. Flag down to the end zone. It's caught. Syracuse touchdown. It's Custis again. Before the ball was ever snapped, they both knew that Eric was going to throw the back shoulder fade. He put it out there where only Custis could get it. Loss of one. Going to receive a screen. Jamal Custis. One of their dangerous wideouts, but well played and a flag. This offense has been humming behind quarterback Eric Dungeon. Under duress here. And he fires, it's going to be caught at the 40-yard line. Wow, Jamal Custis atoning for that earlier drop. But there's a flag down on the far side of the field. They fake the screen, go to Custis, up top. They're going to rule it a catch at the one-yard line. Jamal Custis. I think he got the foot in. Outstanding throw over the shoulder. What a great catch. Tomato given time, going up top. Down the sideline, tiptoe and caught. Express yourself, Jamal Custis. Concentration on the sidelines, but a six foot five, Jamal Custis in a breakout season so far. Custis right down the sidelines, Dustin. Concentration, little push off, he got away with it. Still pick up a first down. They go empty set, quick hitch, caught. Custis with a minimal game. Penalties today for 95 yards. Near side completion is to Jamal Custis, who stays inbounds and on his feet. Don't do anything foolish here with the football. Clemson rushes just three. Dungy has a man floated the pass, and the catch is made by Jamal Custis. He's had a couple of big drops in each of the last two games. Hacker was back in a safety position and didn't get over. You can't give up that play if you're a Clemson defense. Trying to set up a screen, and Tunji finds Custis for a nine-yard gain, nine and a half. Mode of playing not to lose. Oh, fast is their thing. On target and in stride. Tunji to Jamal Custis for a first down to the 35-yard line. 95 yards away in 20 seconds. Second and 30. Custis out of bounds. Country in takeaways for 13 now. Dungy's pass comes near side. Jamal Custis. Sunshine of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Dungy trying to escape. Extends the play, throws on the run, it's complete to Custis, right at the boundary. Got to find a way to convert if you're Syracuse. 9 of 16 in the game on third down. Dungy standing and throwing down the sideline. Custis tried to make the circus over the shoulder grab and did it. Running with Pinnock and Custis makes the catch. Late throw because this ball's out late. Dungy almost talked about getting out of Does he catch it in bounds? Been pretty, pretty porous, but not today so far. Dungy's pass near the goal line. Jamal Custis has it for a touchdown. There is a flag out. An incredible catch from Custis, but again, a penalty marker on the play. It's a big time catch by a big receiver, the senior. In a, in a huge moment, really struggling to get the ball in the end zone under their normal average of plays. Just 33 plays in the first half, looking for the home run. First play, Custis in stride, gets 
some separation, trying to get away and pull down near the 25-yard line by Greg Ross. He has to get right back in this game with a good offensive drive. And DeVito in at quarterback. Yeah, number 13, DeVito going down the sideline. It's caught. Jamal Custis on the first pass from DeVito. Down near the 20. They'll mark him out at the 22-yard line. Playing time was against Florida State where he was outstanding. Led him to victory in the second half. Hits Custis. Who got creased over the middle that previous play. 143 yards passing for DeVito coming in late in the fourth quarter. He tries the other side of the end zone for DeVito. It is a touchdown for the Orange. Jamal Custis on the business end in overtime. Working against Greg Ross one on one. And just throw the jump ball to the 6'5 wide receiver. Why not? Good job of Custis going up and squeezing it. Trying to high point and really pretty good coverage by Ross as well. He's right there. Base for teams that want to try to move up that uh, that ranking. Dungy again over the top. And the deep ball complete down inside the 10 to the big fella. 6'5", Jamal Custis. Runs a 4-5, Beth. And if you don't get close to him, he will run right by you right now. A lot of problems with the DBs. 257 yards of offense in the first quarter. Dungy looking to add to it. To the end zone. Touchdown, Jamal Custis. Everybody is. There's Custis, and he's going to run right up into the seam after this receiver runs a short route. So it's one-on-one, -on -one, a 6-5 wide receiver going against Ingle, a true freshman who's 5-10. It's left in the game and, and took this team to a victory. And that's what he does well, right, Anthony? He can... Dire Straits have got to go score, but they need, need to convert. Dungy. Flag down. Dungy escapes. Now wants to launch. Custis there makes the catch. Inside the 30 of Wake Forest goes Jamal Custis, but will it stand? Amari Henderson was the defender. It's a 36-yard pass play, but usually these markers are for holding. Dwayne Heights, the referee today, is assigned by the ACC. There is no foul on the play. Result of the play, first down. <laughs> well, you see the, the body on the ground. And yeah. Offense and clicking like they want to. Here's Custis on the throw. On the throw from Dungy down to the 25. Offensively, can they create a turnover? Get a stop. There's a throw to Custis. 20 carries, a buck 22 for Dungy. Want to by Bassey and a huge stop for Wake. Hoff Richter. Wow, what a punt to Dorch, who plays at the seven and is taken down by Custis. Run pass down. You do have one of the best kickers in the country. You also have Custis, and he owns a first down for Syracuse. That is fish at a barrel right there. And they'll spread things out with Dungey. Boston College brings a blitz. Dungey being pursued. Lobs one down towards the five-yard line, and it's scooped up by Jamal Custis at the two. First and goal, Orange. Outside the pocket, the awareness, the heads up to put it down the field, and if that thing had a little spiral, it may have been a catch and score, but it doesn't matter. A little more of the zone action, and Lamont all over it. Another blitz. Dungy, easy pitch and catch with Custis. Jamal Custis has a first down, as he was able to drive Lucas Dennis down the sideline. Dungy looks one way, takes a shot towards the end zone, the other way to Custis for the touchdown. Six foot five wins. And he's got full freedom here. You want to stop on a little curl route? You want to keep running? This time he keeps on running. He's got the matchup with the safety there. A perfectly timed and executed throw to go. Let your six five receiver go up and get it. 